Are you a Jotform Enterprise user and want to utilize your own custom domain? Let me show you how. Hey Jotformers, welcome back. I'm Kimberly. And as you can see, I'm currently in the features landing page for custom domains and subdomains. So again, if you are an enterprise user, let's kind of walk through this. And again, don't forget to come back to this features landing page if you have any additional questions. So let's head to my dashboard. Now, first and foremost, if you're wanting to utilize those custom domains and subdomains, we're gonna head up to the top right hand corner. I'm gonna click on my avatar. We're gonna choose our admin console. Then from here, we're gonna choose settings. And right here is where we can choose that domain address. Now, in addition to this, we can even customize our form URL even further. So I'm gonna go ahead and head back and let's choose one of my forms. Let's do this one. Let's do our edit form. We're gonna head up to publish. And right here, we have the ability to edit what this URL looks like. So if I choose the pencil to edit, instead of those numbers, it automatically pulls in the name of this form, which is order form. Now, if we wanna take it a step further and change this again, we can do that. But I think order form fits perfectly for this. Let's go ahead and apply. And now we have a more custom URL for your form. Now, if you have any additional questions about utilizing domains, subdomains, or editing your URL, let us know down below in the comments. If you like this video, when you got some value, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell so you get a notification every time we put out a new video. We'll see you next time.